Getting the workout holy in, man. Fuck, yeah, I'm seeing the the holy holy place of Lex Little's uh, <laughs> strength development gains. No, I saw when he did the video and stuff. Really cool. Thanks, bro. <laughs> also, it's about to go down, bro. Dun, dun, dun. Yeah, just bring up the music. So I just got Joe to sign the wall. His cute little signature. <laughs> Put it nice and tiny. Harry, Harry signed it as well. Uh, I, I got, also got Max, Drew, Marin, Jeremy. Jeremy's one's pretty tough. He put the wall as yours. That's pretty tough. So, oh, also Gabe. You guys seen that though? So the wall is kind of filling out. I'm so happy, man. I, every time somebody comes over, I've been remembering. Like I, I always forgot. Like David's been here, Jesse's been here, a bunch of people, and I just always forgot to ask him to sign the wall. Damn, bro, you're just gonna go in. Uh, literally, no, no pump cover, no nothing. You don't even need one. Uh. I'm not natty, bruh, so I can just start in a tank top. <laughs> Jeez Louise. I'm just cameraman today, so you're gonna see it from this perspective. Harry, you're actually pretty big, man, in real life and stuff. You got nice <laughs> calves, <laughs> like, you, everything looks like. Jeez Louise! Jeez Louise! Wow, you're really shredded. I'll tell you that. Yeah, I'll say it. We have an emergency interruption mid workout. What'd you say? I said that a random kid found our address and wrote you fan mail. Read it. <laughs> now he will be so fucking happy because you found it and you've been reading it in your video. <laughs> I'll oh think my about, God, yeah. I'll think about how I put this in actually, yeah. <laughs> Dear Lex Little, hello Lex, my name is, I go to Arkansas. How the fuck does he have my address? <laughs> I'm writing this letter to you because I wanted to tell you how much you've been spiraling. My dream is to just grow up and not have to worry about anything and I just get to lift all day. I really think it's amazing what you're doing. You're That's what we do. <laughs> you basically escaped the matrix. Your videos inspire me to be myself. Yeah. Lots, lots of heavy weight. I really need to know the secret on how you keep the same energy in every situation. <laughs> I don't. Dude, you've never had any bad things happen. You just lift all day and have no problems. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, he doesn't know. It's very entertaining watching you. I'm very fascinated with your transformation video from being a skinny kid to being huge. I'm trying to get as big as you. I think it's very great that you can be confident in yourself. I hope to be as confident as you someday. I look forward to hearing from you sincerely. Um, Still, you have to consider one thing. What you do and your, your work motivated someone and inspired someone <laughs> to, to find my address them. and send me mail. It is, but to change their life and he's just grateful. Forget about this creep. Uh, you have this, you have again the boring that <laughs> must be some weird shit. Just see it as a, he's thankful and grateful that you do this and you did a good job. Alright, well, um, you're real lucky Joe Statics is here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Really yeah. Nice. You have, uh, you done good. 
and we are happy for you, but don't send any more letters. <laughs> Now, you want to do hundreds or is that too much? Hmm, we can check it out, bro. They're just really fat. Like, they're not, they're really big. They're not like heavy, they're just big. 50 kgs, no? 45? Yeah. No, I think I, I'm enough. max, that's my max, though. I'm not a strong guy. You can do it's it, bro. A, it's more like 46 kg. That's heavy already, bro. Oh, okay. That was really it's heavy. 85, then. Yep. I don't remember how we got here in the first place Can't seem to figure out where we went wrong But when I look up at the stars I see our future So take my hand and we can run So this is basically my new drone. Um, it's called the Inspire 3. The Inspire 3 just came out. Just the body of the drone is $16,000 alone. But you know, there's a lot of reasons as to why this drone is, the down, is a down payment of a car, obviously. There's a lot of things and a lot of technology that only this drone is capable of doing. As you can see from the first few clips of the video, I went out with Jeremy Foster, shout out to him for coming downtown and helping me shoot and stuff. And you know, you can kind of get a feel for the drone and you can just see the pure quality of it despite me having lackluster content and also not having some settings right on the drone. When I have it open in my Mac, I'm, I'm gonna see it a lot more than people on their phones. You probably won't even see anything. You'll probably think it looks beautiful and it honestly will look beautiful. But the point is, is that drone, that's half of the drone's quality, which is crazy to think about that those first clips that looked drastically better than the Mavic 3 or any of the other drones that I've had is half the quality that the drone can achieve considering it can shoot in 8K, 120 frames per second. I was shooting in 4K, not even raw footage in 30 frames a second. So this drone is capable of a lot of things that I haven't even tapped into yet and I can't even maximize. 
Another thing, for example, is it can set waypoints. So you can set a waypoint with this drone and it can literally repeat its route up to one meter precisely within range. And there's actually a stand that I couldn't get because it was out of stock, but there's a stand that makes a, this drone be centimeter accurate. So the drone is basically a tripod. So if, you, if, I had this, if I had this stand, so the drone would sit there so perfectly still it wouldn't even look real. And that would make the waypoints setting even more precise. precise. So this drone also takes lenses, you know, it, it, it has a gimbal as well, obviously on it, like all drones, but it takes real camera lenses and the camera in the drone is better than any camera I have or use for my vlogs. And this is Pry, my most crazy and prized purchase. Like I think I've, one of them I've ever made. This thing, like, and what it's capable of doing and knowing that I have the capability to tap into it, you know, is amazing because, for example, when I bought the FPV drone a while back that you can fly first person, that's actually too complex for me, but this is actually right up my alley and I'm learning more and more and more every day. I actually filmed a segment already where I talked about it, but within two days I've gained so much knowledge about the drone that it, I didn't even want to use that. I'm just re-recording this on an iPhone really quickly to finish off this video. Sorry if I hyped this video up and it seemed like it was crazy. I think the intro was pretty crazy and it was two minutes long, so it was a nice content. There will be more, but I'm just trying to tap into it yet. And I really wanted to show you guys and just announce this because, you know, this drone with all of its equipment was so much money. And you guys know I love content creation. You know, it's like a super, the thing that I'm super passionate about. And um, I've honestly just never been more immersed in an object. Like I, you know, it's just, it's crazy because this thing will do so much for the channel that isn't even possible without it. For example, like another thing, when the city was upside down in the intro or my car and it came, you know, back this, I think this is correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure the inspire three is the only drone capable of getting a 180 degree shot or I guess 90 degree shot upwards. And it's the only drone that can go below 90 degrees, even further back to give you this illusion that you're looking at something upside down. Just the, re the redoing of routes and, you know, you, I can hand the controller to Aaron once I sent the route, set the route. And let's say I'm walking to my car. I can set the drone and fly that route as slow and perfectly as I want. And I can hand the, the remote to Aaron and I can tr keep trying to redo the shot. Cause say it takes me five seconds to walk to my car. The next shot takes me 10. Then one shot takes me three seconds to walk to my car. Aaron can increase the speed perfectly throughout the whole shot up to like 43 miles per hour without it hitting anything or anything. And it's just crazy. And, and also knowing that I do everything by myself and edit these videos and film them pretty much by myself. It's just such a good feeling as well. And this is just more to add on to, you know, me, I guess. And I don't know. And, you know, I this wouldn't be possible without you guys. And I just hope that, you know, the future can show you that this purchase was obviously worth every penny. And, like, I'm only, I'm barely tapping into what this thing can do. Not every vlog is obviously going to have drone shots and stuff. You know, I, I don't want to overdo it. But, you know, there's going to be some things I can do with this drone that are just crazy. And I just, I just love it, man. Like, I really love this thing. And... Thank you guys for making this happen and like, you know, making all my dreams come true and just, you know, I wouldn't be able to do a lot of the things I can do without you guys. Um, and, you know, back in the day, I said this recently in a vlog where I had this vision where I wanted to shoot a shot via a drone, my old gym that I used to train at because growing up, I used to watch David and stuff like that. And I'd see him do that type of stuff. And I always wanted to. And it was like a bucket list to get a shot of it. And you know, recently I went back and sh shot the drone of super fitness and stuff. And it, it makes me think about how there's avenues in, in life. And you know, there's certain things that you'd look at me or anyone, or I look at someone else. And I think, you know, could I ever really do that? Like, is that even possible? And you know, my knowledge for drones, cameras, like 360 cameras, how to set it up, what software to download, whatever, like everything's just an obstacle. And once you overcome it, you just always have that knowledge on like how to do a lot of things. Like for example, like I can fly this thing perfectly fine, just a lot of it. But you know, what I'm getting at is there was a point in time where I didn't, I didn't own any of these things and I could only dream of doing the things that I do on the channel. And I could only dream of getting the, the shots I can get and you know, the visions that I had and I couldn't do anything about, you know? So when you have a dream and, and you, and you, you see someone that you look up to or someone that you think is doing something awesome that you would like to do, but you feel like you have no idea where to start or what to do, you know, all that's in the way, all that's ever in the way of you doing what you need to do is, you know, you just taking the steps to do it and learning.
and you'll you can do anything i feel like because you know this is just such a surreal thing to me like to have this and you know yeah this this is my new drone you know i'm, I'm going on a rant and but yeah this is my new drone it's the inspire 3 another thing that's really annoying about it is um i never own an inspire 2 so i don't have any directions really like intuitionally and the inspire 3 like i feel like only a hand people a handful of people in the world have it so i can't search up any videos to help because like nobody has it but you know every i'm, I'm just really proud of this shit like i feel like this is like a car or something mm -hmm. i mean it is it, it literally is it was like 25 g's or something and if you're wondering with the tax situation you guys are kind of maybe i would okay I was blowing out of proportion, and I think you guys were too. Like, yes, I had to pay an extremely, extremely, extremely hefty amount of taxes, but first of all, I bought this before I paid my taxes. So that can answer that question. And two, you know, that was a month or two ago, and I'm financially already fine. It was just in that specific moment where I already had just paid my taxes, you know, I was, I was like, damn, but now I'm good. And also, I bought this before I paid my taxes and everything like that. It was supposed to get here in August, but it magically came like last week. And I was like, what? Like, I was so hype about it. So, um, I love you guys and it wouldn't be possible without you. And like, you know, I hope, I hope I really can take advantage of this. And like, I just love creating, you know, it's just, it's hard to get out of the house sometimes and do it. But once I do it, it's always the most fulfilling thing. Like that intro to this video was just the most fulfilling thing to me, man. Yeah, like, guys, he literally showed me it like five times. It's just like, it's the most fulfilling purpose filled happy you know serotonin releasing thing when i think of something to do and i go do it and then i make it happen it's like well it's, it's yeah. rare for people to have those visions and actually make it exactly come true exactly how you pictured it and that's why like and you're so talented what's fucked up is i was actually going to make the car intro even longer but you know the batteries died and I, I have six batteries they just die pretty quickly all right guys well love you guys i'll see you in the next video please drop a like in the video it really helps me out also, you know, if you buy anything from Young LA, please use code Lex because that directly goes to the videos since I don't make any money off of these videos because I use because I use copyright music. So, yeah, uh, love you guys so much, man.